Now that we've looped the bridge over, let's cross it with the driver of the train. According to a pleasant little superstition, if a passenger writes a wish on a piece of paper and wraps it round a coin and tosses it from the carriage window, the wish will come true if it falls into the water. But if it doesn't fall into the water, it's still good luck, though not to the person who threw it. Higher up, another bridge spans the fort, the lovely Brig of Stirling, once the key to the Highlands. Here at Stirling Castle, they put a crown on the head of James VI and a rattle in his hand. He was aged 13 months at the time. Alexander I died here and so did William the Lion but perhaps you've never even heard they were ill. The Argyle and Sutherland Highlanders. In this garden, Mary, aged eight months, took her pram ride before they crowned her Queen of Scots. Here, in Greyfriars Church. Such a heavy crown for such a tiny head. Only eight months before her crowning, she had uttered her first cry in Linlithgow's royal palace, in this very room. Lochleven Castle, Mary's prison where more tears were shed, until the Queen escaped in a rowing boat. The royal lodgings, Edinburgh Castle, where they took Mary's crown when she no longer had a place to put it. A happier queen and happier times lived here, at Balmoral. Queen Victoria said of this view that it was the fairest sight in all fair Scotland. Her castle at Balmoral was built with 500,000 pounds, left her in his will by an old miser of Chelsea. The gracious lady on the penny, as she was called by Peter Pan's elder brother. James Matthew Barry was born at number nine, Lilybank, Terry Muir. And the house he immortalized in his book, The Window in France. Fish caught at Aberdeen in the morning are in London that evening. Aberdeen also exports enormous cargoes of Scotch jokes, slow and heavy. A careless Aberdonian once dropped a thripney bit into the harbour. He jumped in after it, but couldn't swim. And the fiscal returned the verdict as death from natural causes. One day we found an old beggar playing in the street. Could you no spare me a copper, mister? Ah, oh, war, said the Aberdonian. You're just wasting your time, man. We all do a rain whistling here. Cumberland House. Now the home of beggars, where the victor of Culloden, the butcher as some called him, stayed after defeating Prince Charlie. But poverty produces leisure, and leisure produces golf. The Kitty. The Clubhouse. Steady, Daddy, steady. Final round begins. Hold in one. Now then, Daddy. Scotch mist. Better luck next time. Critics. The 
last hope. This is the great Cumberland stroke of fate. Bad luck. They call him Bobby Jones. He doesn't mind. Got it. The victor. The spoiled. Another of Scotland's sports. Plenty of water for her bridges. But Invercall Bridge should be approached reverently. For here Robert Louis Stevenson strolled when his rich fancy was coining Treasure Island. wanderers up the river Dee, from the distant ocean, these salmon, animated by an invincible domestic motive, these fish come in from the sea. I mean they go from sea to Dee, to spawn. This fellow's domestic urge is more passionate than it seems. It's a slow motion camera. Let romance lead us also deeper in the highlands. The Pass of Killy Cranky. In many such crofts as these, Bonnie Prince Charlie sought and found a refuge. And no peat cutter was so poor as to betray his royal guest, though a princely reward was on his head. castle behind the village of Inverary, the Duke of Argyll lived, Prince Charlie's inveterate foe. His name is immortalized in a prayer heard around the world. God bless the Duke of Argyll for his posts. It's the oatmeal that makes the itching, the oatmeal and the haggis. Fair for your own his sonsy face, great chieftain o' know the pudding race. I've been the more you attack your place, faith tripe and firm. Will are you worthy or a grace as Lang's mayor? Here was born the poet whose songs the world will never forget. And here, at Mount Oliphant, he learned too soon the sorrows of the poor. Well, the sun shines bright on the floor. 